What's going on, everybody? Brian Fonseca checking in on behalf of the Action Network. And today, we have two massive fights that we are going to place bets on. So let's get right into it. First up, we have Amanda Serrano, who is the undisputed featherweight champion of the world and one of the best pound-for-pound -pound boxers of all time. 45-2 and two with one draw and 30 wins by way of knockout. Serrano is going to be defending most of her featherweight crown against Danilo Ramos because not all of her world titles are on the line. We'll get to that in a second. Danilo Ramos is 12-2 and two with one win by knockout. Amanda Serrano is going to be defending her titles in a bout that is going to be 12 rounds, not the typical 10-round title fight that women have in boxing, and it's going to be three-minute rounds unlike the typical two-minute rounds that women have in title fights in boxing. This is going to be under what is quote-unquote men's rules, and Amanda Serrano is going to be starring in this. This is the first bout of its kind in 16 years for women in boxing, and because of this, there are a couple of organizations who don't want their belt defended in this fight but nevertheless Amanda Serrano is the undisputed featherweight queen and I am picking her to win this bout now she's a minus 2,000 favorite so duh but how are we going to get there Amanda Serrano is not just one of the best pressure fighters in the women's division she's one of the best pressure fighters of all time one of the best boxers of all time her resume would indicate that and because of that we are rolling with her to win this fight. We're going to look at method of victory, and we are going to pick her to win by knockout or technical knockout, plus 110 at the time of this recording was plus 135 last week. So if you think that's how this fight is going to end, I suggest you jump on this very quickly. And a second bet that I like on this fight is if you're picking Amanda Serrano to win between rounds 7 through 12, you can get that as of this recording at plus 175. So I am playing that as well because I think Amanda Serrano is going to get a later stoppage. And because there's going to be an increase in time in this fight, remember 12 rounds, not 10, three minutes, not two. I think you're more likely to get an Amanda Serrano stoppage. So we're going to bet on that and then move on to our next fight. The crossover super fight, which is in boxing, but contested between Boxing's unified heavyweight champion in Tyson Fury, nearly undisputed, and former UFC heavyweight champion Francis Ngannou, who was making his boxing debut after leaving the promotion for PFL not long ago. Tyson Fury is obviously more skilled, and we don't really need to break down why he's going to win this bout, but he's going to win this bout unless something shocking happens. And Tyson Fury is undefeated in boxing. I don't think he's going to lose. As great as Francis Ngannou was in the heavyweight division there, Tyson Fury is the best heavyweight boxer in the world and really one of the best heavyweight boxers of all time. He's not somebody you're going to beat in your first boxing match, even if Mike Tyson is training you. First off, we have Tyson Fury by exact method of victory. Tyson Fury by technical knockout, minus 165. Not amazing value there, but the more likely outcome. I don't think he's going to knock Francis Ngannou flat out, though. It could happen, but we're going to roll with the TKO that Francis Ngannou goes out on his shield and gets stopped by Tyson Fury, as opposed to just being laid out with one shot. And one more bet for this bout. We're going with Tyson Fury to win and over one and a half knockdowns. That right now is even money, minus 110. We're going to play that because we feel quite good about Tyson Fury getting at least one knockdown. So why not another en route to a TKO? So that's Tyson Fury to win and over one and a half knockdowns at minus 110. And Tyson Fury to win straight up by technical knockout minus 165. That's all we have for today. Thank you for watching and enjoy the fights.